Hello guys, it's me RG and uh, welcome back to my channel. So uh, today we're going to unbox and review this uh, high grade Gundam Barbados from the Iron Blooded Orphans series. Okay, so uh, this is how the uh, front of the box looks like and this is the side. So we have here different poses, um, optional uh, clock, okay. Okay, we have here pilot. Nothing much to see, so let's just open the box and look at the contents. Okay, so we have here one, two plastic bag, plastic bag of runners, white sticker. And the uh, user menu. Okay, so we have here the pilot Mikazuki. Okay. The, the diagram inside looks clear. Very easy to understand. Nothings. Okay, and if you see here, you can see here, guys. Uh, this is the uh, first form of Barbados without the uh, uh, shoulder armor, and the, the left arm has the gauntlet. So, if you want the uh, fourth form or the original form. So you just need to attach the shoulder armor and uh, change the left arm to this form. Okay, let me see. Okay. So uh, enough with the uh, manual. Let's go ahead and look at the uh, runners. By the way, guys, commercial Una. Um. In all of my videos, I'll be putting time codes in the description box below. Okay, so if you're uh, looking for a specific topic or you're in a hurry, you can skip through uh, topics by using the time codes below. Okay, so uh, please check that out. Thank you. Okay, so uh, let's uh, start the review. So uh, let's review the uh, appearance first. So uh, this is how uh, the high grade Barbados looks like. Okay, let's take a closer look. And let's take a look at the back. Okay, so the uh, weapons are uh, attached to the uh, backpack here okay so this is the long sword and the uh, needle mace okay so uh, for the appearance um, if you guys already watched my uh, previous review about the uh, no grade 1 over, one over 100 scale Barbados sixth form. Okay, um, if you compare the appearance of this high grade to that low grade, I might say, in my opinion, uh, this is this slightly looks better than the one over one hundred scale. Okay, so because um, for me, um, if you talk about no grade 1 over 100 scale it's kind of like a larger version of the high grade but in this case this is this slightly looks better than the 1 over 100 scale no grade uh, Barbados okay now um, if we look here we have here the uh, first form 
so it doesn't have the uh, shoulder armor it has the uh, gauntlet here okay um, again uh, I'm always impressed with uh, Barbatos the design of Barbatos I like the uh, color separation between uh, white red and blue and the yellows okay um, as for the stickers the stickers are okay I use the stickers at the knee and the gray parts here uh, at the eyes okay so the stickers are okay but um, I think I would prefer if uh, you will just paint it over the uh, parts but it's still fine yeah you can still use the stickers if you can notice here it looks okay so as for the appearance I can still rate this um, 8 out of the 8 out of 10 sorry let's move on to the quality so uh, again Bandai hasn't um, messed up any of the qualities when if you talk about the uh, coloration or mold patterns uh, as much as I have uh, inspected this I didn't notice any imperfections um, I like the quality of the joints it's very stable and firm uh, the build the snapping is okay as well uh, it's not hard snaps and it's not too loose okay so for the quality um, I can say it's uh, around 9 out of 10 now uh, let's move on to articulation let's uh, let's remove the weapons first okay so uh, I'll attach this so that you will see how the shoulder armor articulates later so again if you attach the uh, shoulder armor then this will be the uh, original form of Barbados the fourth form okay so for the articulation let's start at the head so the head actually Okay, it can tilt down and up this much and uh, it can rotate 360 degrees and there's a uh, slight side to side movement okay as for the uh, shoulder so the shoulder armor can actually move up and down Okay, just be careful because it's just attached uh, to a small peg, okay? Oops. Okay, so for the arm, you can actually raise up to 90 degrees, okay? And uh, the shoulder itself can actually move forward and back a bit sorry okay and uh, the arms can rotate 360 degrees now as for the elbow it's connected by a double joint so it can flex up to this much and the uh, the fist so it's it has the uh, holding hand here it can rotate 360 degrees with a slight side to side movement so it's connected by a ball joint okay for the torso um, it has a slight more forward and back movement like this okay so you can see the fixed piston here okay 
so that's an additional detail here that you might want to paint for customization so uh, for the rotation it can rotate 360 degrees and it doesn't have side to side movement so for the back we have here the uh, backpack this part which holds the, the weapon can rotate 360 degrees and the middle part of the thruster can move up and down like that so this part is just a white sticker sorry okay so uh, going down to the to the waist the front skirt can move up and down side skirts can also move okay as for the back skirt it is fixed okay let's move down to the legs so let's raise this up okay so for the leg it can move forward this much and back up to this extent only because of the back skirt okay for the side sideward movement it can it can do splits and as for the knee so it's double joint so you can bend it this much okay okay so uh it's nice that there is an exposed uh part here it's like a cable metal cable as for the the foot let's fix this first okay for the foot um it can move back and forward like this this um, armor here can also move so the front part of the foot can move up and down and it has sideways movements as well so it's a bit stiff but it can move sideways okay so um, the articulation of this uh, Gundam kit is actually very good okay so it would be easy to uh, post this kit in uh, any direction that you want so for the uh, articulation of this kit I would say it's around uh, 8 out of 10. Okay, so uh, as for the ease of build, um, I did not encounter any problem uh, building this kit. This is a very easy kit to build. It's not, it's not uh, hard snap and I did not see any loose parts either. So uh, as long as you follow the, uh, the diagram or the user manual you can easily build this kit as for the, the rating I can uh, rate this uh, 10 out of 10 it's really easy to build this kit okay guys before we go to the summary um, I'll just want to show you the weapons so uh, this is the uh, needle mace okay so uh, compared to the 1 over 100 scale uh, barbatos the uh, needle uh, mace in the 1 over 100 scale can can move so you can actually push this forward and this part will extend now for the uh, high grade it's fixed 
so uh, there's no gimmick here but still it, it still looks nice okay now uh, the extra weapon the longsword is also uh, included in this kit so uh, it's uh, pretty simple very simple looking uh, longsword so uh, I wish we can have more separation or details here but I cannot complain uh, enough with this it's it looks good already so uh, these are the two included weapons in uh, the high grade Gundam Barbados Okay, so uh, let's summarize our review. Uh, for the appearance, this is actually uh, a very nice looking Gundam. Uh, for the quality, again, I did not see any flaws um, aside from the quality of the stickers. But the um, sticker is still good, so uh, I wouldn't mind it. Now, as for the articulation, again, uh, it has good articulation um, you can easily post this uh, kit without any problems uh, as well as the ease of build you won't encounter any problem building this it's very easy uh, snap build experience so um, if you will ask me if I can recommend this high-grade uh, Gundam Barbatos definitely yes um, if you will choose between the uh, 1 over 100 scale no grade and this one in my opinion i will go with the high grade so uh, you will get a lower price as well as a slightly better um, appearance or details with this okay so uh, that's it for my review. If you uh, find this helpful, uh, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Okay? And uh, by the way, before I let you go, guys, um, I just want, I, I will just uh, make an announcement. Okay, so we are uh, a new channel and we are slowly growing in uh, numbers. So thank you guys for that, for my subscribers. Now, um, to celebrate the uh, 100 subscriber mark, I'm uh, planning to do a raffle, okay? So for the raffle, um, once we reach 100 subscribers, I will give out one high-grade Barbados as well exactly the same as this okay so I have an extra box with me not open okay so I will give it out once we reach 100 subscribers and uh, for the mechanics of this raffle just stay tuned for uh, my next video I will create a separate video for the raffle mechanics okay so uh, thank you so much guys for uh, the support and um, Again, keep on subscribing and liking. Uh, don't uh, don't be shy to leave a comment below if you have uh, something to say or ask. Okay? Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye guys!